Welcome back. Um, uh, I got real power in Evil Evil XD continuing the Super Mario Party. Fucking uh, uh, tier list, baby. Let's get into this shit. All right. Next character up we have is Big Bad Boy. I'm looking for his name. Koopa uh, Trooper. Trooper! Ooh, I'm excited to debate this one. He's no, he's awful. He's god awful. All right, so let's get into Koopa Troopa. Uh, first thing off, he's worse than drive bombs. Okay, um, <laughs> you can say that. Okay, he's one, one, two, three, three, and then a motherfucking ten. <laughs> what the fuck? Mm -hmm. One, one, two, three, the ten. No, one, one, two, two threes, and then a ten. So yeah, so Koopa's weird. Koopa's weird. Koopa's all over the fucking place. Okay, not only he doesn't have any mid roll, which is bad for items and shit like that. He doesn't have any mid roll, and his low rolls, even then, are just a little too high. Cause yeah. Because he's got a three, and that's bad. That's a bad roll. Because three, three is three is bad. That usually lands you on three is a pretty bad number in general, because it's not really high enough to get any good distance, and it's usually not like the most. It's just three is kind of bad, which is why Mario is not fantastic. Um, I mean, the reason why only reason why Mario is better good is because he's better than normal dice block. Yeah. Um, no, he's not. He's not completely better, but he's majority of the time better than normal dice box. But we're not. Like, we're not. We're not in Mario like, yet. I feel like Koopa is in between Koopa and, Troopa and Goomba. Oh, you think he's between Hammer Brother and Goomba? Goomba. Yeah. That's I. Cool. But I honestly think he's worse than regular dice block. Yeah. I do think he's worse than regular dice block. So you're. I'm gonna say second to last in F tier. Because I do think Monty Mo is the worst character in the game. <laughs> Waluigi. Yeah, okay, so he's either top or second to last in F tier. Which is he's either first or second in F tier. For me, anyways. He could be middle E tier if you want. Uh yeah, you know what? The more I'm thinking about it, the less application I have <laughs> for Koopa Troop. For uh Koopa Troopa. He's, he's I'm really bad. He's I think he may be the top F tier. Top F tier? I d um, yeah. Because uh, he's just you. like. I feel like he's the gleaming, shiny rock on the pile of garbage that is F tier. <laughs> yeah, but he's so worse than literally everybody else. Okay, we're putting Koopa Troopa at tough, tough F tier. Because at least there's. There's at least a chance to get a good. A good roll. Like, uh. Like a death. Yoshi! <laughs> Dang, that's Luigi, dude. Are you stupid? <laughs> <laughs> All right, next character up. They're both green. I'm sorry. Okay, Lu is the is Green Lu Mario Luigi himself? Luigi's <laughs> a weird. Luigi's weird. He's very similar to the Dry Bones, but okay. So Luigi is one one one. So exactly the same as Dry Bones so far. Five six seven. I feel like he's just a worse version of Dry Bones. I do think he's, honestly, yeah. yeah he's, he's kind at of. Least, at least you get some. Uh... Here's the thing with Luigi. So basically, uh, just like Dry Bones, you take a 50 50 coin flip. Yep. And then Dry Bones is consistently a 6 if you win. Luigi's is either lower than that, same as that, or higher than that. Mm -hmm. which, 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 listen to that, is two thirds better. There's only one sixth of a chance that Luigi's dice block is worse than Dry Bones. Think about it like that. Yeah, there's. Yeah, but there's only one time when he's better and one time when he's worse. It kind of equals out. Yeah. I think Luigi, be, I... just because he doesn't have that same consistency as Dry Bones, is worse than Dry Bones. Yeah, I guess so. I would put him uh, last in D tier behind Dry Bones. Yeah. All right. Okay. Because he's still better than the normal Dry Spot. It's. I mean, he's not much better, but at least. Is a little bit. All right. Okay. Next up, we're on. This is the wrong one. Next we're up on to Mario. Now Mario. Mario might take a second to. Uh, okay. So we got one, three, 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 five, six. So I think he's a C tier. He seems like the I, I middle, think... the most middle of the road guy in the entire game. I. Yeah. Um. That's. 
Um. Okay, Owen, what do you have to say about Mario? Um, I would say you would have to be C tier, because it's just like a mid range person. It seems like if you want to roll a three, there's not much on a three, but you could roll a but three. But Daisy's better than him. Daisy, Donkey Kong. No, Daisy's just straight up a better version of Mario. Yeah. And, so, like, and the better version of Daisy is Shy Guy. Yeah. So, but I feel like he has, he's better than, is he better than, uh, Bowser Jr.? Yeah, and... he's better than Bowser Jr. Because his dice block is just so, it's just kind of a better version of the regular dice block. Because you're sacrificing two and four for consistent threes, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, which I think is better in most cases. At least he has a consistent role. He seems like he's the most bland to tell. He's the, he's a little bland to tell. He's he's top at C tier in my opinion. Top C tier or second top C tier? I think that's where you should put him. Second top C tier. Second top C. -tier. Okay, uh, we're putting him right there. Scores all around the fucking place. He is. He's he's kind of just like the same as the normal dice block, but more consistent. Oh, and I would we got say, the mole bit. Oh, yes! Monty Mole! <laughs> let's get it out of the way! <laughs> Alright, okay, let's... Oh, God, damn let's, it. Let's go and reason why Monty Mole's fucking garbage. <laughs> Alright? So listen. Plus one, two, three, four, five, six. The fuck? So, plus one coin, or... So, it's a zero. So, zero, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so Literally listen. just the same as... Okay, so let's just get into this right now. What's better, zero or a one? One. Because I would say if you land on an unlucky space in front of you, you'd at least not have the chance to play. But what if you land on an unlucky spot? Then you want to... Here's the it, problem! It's not consistent! It's there's no nothing consistent about, about his dice. dice. Yeah, there's no... No, because no, here's the thing, though. You have the regular dice block for... The reason why this game works and it's got a strategy is because you take your dice block, and then you take the regular dice block, and that should make, like, a perfect consistency, you know what I mean? But the problem is that Monty Moles is the same as the regular dice block, so, like, there's no real difference. And, like, the only reason you roll Monty Moles is if you're on a good space and you want to do it again. But even then, there's just so many better characters for doing that. Like, like Donkey Kong is that perfect character. Yeah, Donkey Kong is fucking quadruple zero man over there. <laughs> so, like, the Monty Mole doesn't help you. It doesn't help you at all. His dice block is shit. Yeah, but I still think there is... So, on some dice blocks that work better than, uh... No, never mind. You know what? Screw it. He, he's the worst. He, he, he literally is the worst. <laughs> yeah. We're at the end of that. Wait a second. I got objections? No. I just realized that Yoshi's just better than Waluigi. We're not there yet, but you guys are gonna lose your shit when we get to those two, because he's literally just better than Waluigi. <laughs> not even, like, not even, like, a thing where people could be subjective with us, like, saying, Shy Guy's better than Yo Daisy. He's literally just better than Waluigi. <laughs> I'm not even joking. They have the exact same dice block, but Waluigi has negative three and Yoshi has zero. <laughs> he's literally just better than Waluigi. So that means, and if Yo and Yoshi's dice block, I would say, is middle F tier. Um, so that means Monty Mole is quadruple in the F tier over here. Yeah, he, he has to be, like, all the way over. Okay, like, all the way in there. He might need to go off the screen. There's He's just there's, so bad. There's Monty Mole. He's... Okay, no. For real, though, there's Monty Mole. Yeah. Alright. To the next one! Peach! The, the slut. Uh, no. I mean, she only kissed one person. Alright, so Peach. Peach. Okay, Peach is actually not that bad. Just worse Shy Guy. Just worse Shy Guy. Okay, zero, two, four, 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 six. She seems like a better version of Mario. You are pretty much right. So I think she should be top of C tier. Yeah, I, yeah, that's just a quick one. She's just kind of a better Mario. Less cons gets... less consistent, but also at the same no, time. No, she has three fours, isn't she? Yeah, so, yeah, she's just better than Mario. She's overall just better than Mario. Okay. Alright, that's good. Alright. Pom pom. Pom pom, yo. She's a weird ass character. Alright, pom I think she's top of Okay. Right, let's explain the dice. Okay, okay. So zero, three, 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 eight. So in case you missed that, that's one zero, 
four threes and one eight. What's so, that eight doing? It's this is exactly my thought. <laughs> it's so, like it's all the way at the end and it's just there. It's just it's just like if I would say more risk, more reward is usually better in Mario Party, but in this case, she's she's just kind of a worse Mario. Yeah. I mean here's the thing though, Mario rolls she rolls threes more consistently than Mario. The problem is is that you don't need that consistency. Uh, as okay, because here's the thing. She's like it's weird, okay, because she has more threes than Mario, right? Yes. But also at the same time, she's got that weird fucking eight. Like the eight just screws it. I mean, at least in Mario, you know you're guaranteed to get in through the one through six. But this, you're just opening up a whole uh, Pandora's box of possibilities. You've got a zero, you got an eight. Those just two outliers screw the whole dice over. And I would say he's mid C tier. I mean, she's mid C tier. I'm gonna put it on. I feel like she's still pretty good though. Those no, I th are... honestly, honestly though. That's two thirds. If, if we if we didn't put Peach at top C tier, I would have put Pom Pom better than Mario. I would have, but I don't think so. I don't I... think she's better than Mario. Fuck you. Um. So okay, so okay. Owen, where do you want to place her? Hmm. Where do you want to place her? Third C. Third C. I agree with that. Yeah, that's what I was thinking exactly. That or top D. There's somebody I think that goes there. Yeah, <laughs> someone special. Someone All right. Okay. Next. Special. Okay. Yeah. Uh, that someone special I think is Rosalina. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Okay. So let's get into Rosalina for a second here, because Rosalina is weird. Um. Okay, so let's talk about Rosalina. So she is plus two, plus two, two, three, four, eight. The fuck? So she's just less consistent than Pom Pom, but she can get more money. But as we've established, it doesn't really mean anything. No. And I think she has. Honestly, she seems like the perfect fit for top of D tier. She's a better version of Bowser Jr., you know. Have as much randomness. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Because here's the thing, though. Um, comparing her to Bowser Jr. in particular, she has. Honestly, I would say she's a pretty okay. Fuck you. All. But I would say that she's pretty much top of D tier. Really? Uh, I top not of top of D tier. <laughs> Your dick. Wait, yeah. Uh, uh, so I think we all came to a consensus. This is a pretty easy choice. All right. We're kind of getting down, this might not even have to be a three-parter, because we're getting down to the last uh, characters. We should just leave Ro Ro Roji? Yes. Yeah, so, I know where we're putting Shy Guy, but let's just talk about why we're putting him there. Right? What? Yeah, in the middle B tier? In the middle of B tier. So, okay, yeah, he's literally in, I think he's literally in the perfect place. Yeah. No, he's not. No, he's not. What? Fuck that. What, is he going, uh, upper A? He's, I, I would put him there, but... Um, the problem is, is that with how we've made the tier list, I would have put him second A tier, but I do feel like we have to put him middle B tier. Because I don't think Diddy Kong is better than him, but it's so it's such a weird matchup. I feel like Shy Guy doesn't have... Yo, we've been hyping up Shy Guy this entire time. He's just gonna end up mid B tier. What the <laughs> shit? I don't know, because I don't feel like he's better than Diddy Kong. I love how we didn't even see the dice roll for him yet. Oh shit, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> oh, right, we did the dice that. roll. We're just blabbering on about him. And, okay, and listen, like, no more uh, hype for Shy Guy. Are you ready for, <laughs> are you ready for this? <laughs> sure. Okay, zero. The rest of it is four. <laughs> so it's just so much consistent four. I love this dice block just because I, you get that if, if four, the lucky space, that coins, those items. This is that character. If I was gonna play this game, I mean, sorry, when I when I play this game, I always choose Shy Guy. I think he is an incredible character. He's just the cutest, I think. I yeah, I, I think he's gosh. really fucking good, but unfortunately, just because if we're going into technical issues, Boo and Bowser are better than him. Yeah, because... But if we're he's, talking the, about he's, stars, he's the most fun character to play. In my, in my opinion, I think he's the most fun character to play. So... But if we're talking about getting stars, which is the main goal of the game, 
Boo, Bowser, Diddy Kong, all are better at getting that movement to get that star. Honestly, if you want to get items, Shy Guy is the best. But the way that the tier list is structured, I think that we should have uh, those guys above Shy Guy. Alright, so we're down to the absolute oh, worst shit. shitty characters. <laughs> oh! Waluigi! Fuck a tall ass man. Waluigi's just there. He's just there. <laughs> just no, no dice roll, just eat No, that. he's got, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, it's a minus three? Yep. Minus three, one, three, five, seven. No, five, five, seven. Five, five, seven. He's garbage. He's um, garbage. <laughs> he, he's really just garbage. I don't want to go into it. He's just really fucking garbage. I mean, there's one application for Waluigi and his counterpart, Yoshi, and that is that Yoshi's been. No, so there's a partner mode in which you roll for, uh... Two people? Two, it's two people, and you combine the rolls. Yeah. And when you need stars, it's... You can't... You can only get it if you have an even or odd roll. And while Ouija and Yoshi are both good at getting you consistently odd rolls, C combine that with someone who gets a consistently even roll... Or, uh, like, someone like Pom Pom gets another consistently odd roll. That way you can always roll an even, or always roll an odd. And then, or someone like Shy Guy, especially. Yeah, so let's go into reason why Yoshi's just better than Waluigi. So as we stated before, Waluigi's got negative three, one, some other shit, five, five, seven. Yoshi has the exact same dice roll, but instead of a negative three, it's a zero. Really? Yeah. Did they not think of that? No, he's just better than Waluigi. <laughs> <laughs> There's literally no reason to play Walu Yoshi over Waluigi. That's I'm so not true. even joking. <laughs> There's no reason to play him. Like that's, that's, that is so that is so true to the character. All right, no, yeah, yeah negative three, one, three, five, five, seven, zero, one, three, five. Nope, he's just better. He's, he's just, just better. He's just better. <laughs> that's so poor Waluigi. He's not even good in Mario Party. <laughs> Any game where there's a tier list, he's garbage. All right, well Waluigi's trash. <laughs> he's just there's literally no. It's stupid. There's no reason to play him. There's no reason to play him. You literally only play Yoshi. I mean, the only reason to play Waluigi is if you want to see body and the mustache. There's, there's no reason. There's no other reason. He's bad. Okay, okay. The last person. Wow, yeah. I skipped Wario because we wanted to get to Yoshi, but yeah. Is he gonna go on to him? No, he's no, no. He's going. Uh, no, he's up. up here. Uh, he's, he's there. He's a worse. He's more consistent than Boo. Okay, but if we're looking for people who can really roll far. It's, uh... Negative 2, negative 2, 4 sixes. I think that explains itself. Where it goes. So, poor, poor hole in E tier. Poor hole in E tier. Uh, We're not gonna try to... We can't, really. But, I, I, like, I was gonna lie my way through this, but I don't think there's a way to put Mario in there, so then... No. There's... He's... It's perfect where he is. If you're looking for someone who rolls high, you wanna go with either Boo or Bowser over Wario, just because it's always a chance to roll high. And if you want that chance to roll high, it's better to have Boo than Wario. I mean, you're going to get consistent sixes with Wario. Yeah, but, yeah, it's... it When you want to roll high, it's not about consistency, it's about getting that high roll. I really thought we were going to have more people in S tier, but I do... See, Bowser's the only one so, <laughs> in S tier. So, but, so, so, Boo and Bowser... I mean, Boo and Wario. Yeah, they both have. We do. We don't even need to go into this. We've already explained it enough. <laughs> yeah, All right. yeah. I, but that's that's our Super Mario Party tier list. Take it from the professionals here that definitely have put more hours into this game than any other person in the history of mankind. I mean, honestly, we have played and watched uh, Mario Party in every waking and sleeping hour. Just yeah. kidding. We don't sleep. We only play Mario Party. Yeah, so how about ghosts? Yes. Yes. Are you dead? Yes. Yes. Black yes. Asleep. yes. yes. Right. And screw all the people who put Donkey Kong at number one. Goodbye. Bye.